What they are looking for are untrainable skills, which are uh, more in terms of officer-like qualities. That uh, will you crack under pressure? Uh, will uh, do you have the ability to work as a team? Can you uh, get other people to uh, work with you without being threatened by you? Uh, you may be a great uh, uh, performer, but if you piss off everyone else in your team, or if everyone else in the team views you as a competition or as a as a person who likes to hog all the limelight, you may be the you know a stud, but you'll never go beyond an individual contributor. You'll never be able to run a team. Yeah. And uh, in the army, it's all about the team. It's all 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 people together. It's never you know eight of us got in, but twelve didn't get through. It doesn't make sense. I mean, it's all the twenty have to get in, or all yeah. it's all or nothing. It's so it, it's th that format. Now that format requires people to be able to look at the bigger picture. It requires them to think out of the box uh, for problem solving. You must remember that in the army, I think what they teach uh, most people is fundamental problem solving. That is why you are able to take the same troops and send them for flood relief in Chennai, for earthquake in Nepal, for building a commonwealth bridge in uh, Delhi, for taking children out of a borewell when they are stuck there. I mean, there is no training given for taking children out of a borewell. That doesn't happen in the academy. What happens is you are taught how to solve problems as a group. And I think that's what they're looking at. They're looking at uh, whether people have an open mind, whether they can do that kind of stuff, or are they too fixated? Is their cup too full? Is there too self-centered? Self then those, those are the traits which uh, will probably be a, a sort of a disadvantage. They also have a very intensive psychological um, profiling, uh, and they have tests, which I'm sure you can Google and find out about word association or uh, writing uh, uh, narrative based on a picture that you're shown. And this is more to look at. Uh, but the interesting thing is that there are three different vectors that happen. So there's a group task, there is an individual psychological assessment, and then there is an interview. And what they also look for is inconsistency between the three. So if, if anyone, and that's why I recommend to a lot of people that you might want to take some basic uh, guidelines, but don't try and get coached on it.